Hey, in this video, we're going to look at how Zotero can import the metadata for newspaper stories. So we can see here, I'm on the English version of the New York Times. I'm just going to randomly click whatever story is on the front page. So I open up the story. Here's the newspaper story opening. And we can see up here, the Zotero icon has changed to a little rolled up newspaper. So when I click this, I've got the newspaper icon. Here's the title. Again, we choose which folder we want it to go in, and we can see here, it's adding it in here, and it's putting in all the metadata that we would need. Similarly, if I go to the BBC, and again, I choose a, an article on the BBC page, we can see here again, there's the little newspaper icon coming up. Click that, choose the folder, and again, that's added. Ah, let's try one more. The independent newspaper in the UK, so let's choose a story. Now on this one, there's a video embedded here as well as the text. So I'm not sure if it's because of the video or just because of the way the website is set up, but on some newspapers, the Zotero icon doesn't change to a newspaper icon. It stays at a website icon. So we can still click this and we can still add it to the ABC1 folder. However, some of the information might be a little bit wrong because when we go in here, it's telling us it's a web page. So we'll need to change that to a newspaper article. Now we can see here the author's name, the journalist's name is missing. Whereas in here, we can actually see it's May Bullman. So we would need to go in here and we would manually add her name. A few other things we need to check. Title, Windrush Generation Members. Title is correct. Uh, publication, place, edition. We don't need to worry about that. The dates are correct. So now it's looking better. We just needed to add the author's name. But sometimes there might be a few other issues here that you'll need to change when we're changing from newspaper article to website. But that's how we use Zotero to import newspaper stories. Now, occasionally, as I say, you might not get any icon coming up. It's a really old paper newspaper. You don't have it as an online version. It's the print version you have. So again, we can go to the plus section here, choose more, choose newspaper article, and here, from the paper version, you can manually type in title, journalist's name, publication, etc, etc, so that we can still make an entry for it. So, that's how we deal with newspaper articles for Zotero. 